wanna know his secret. Hey, what's going on, guys? Um, today I'll be showing you how to um, make a website and create a website from start to finish using a template. I use I start with templates on every single website. Okay. Um, I'll be using Dreamweaver CS6. Okay. So let's start by going to Google. Okay. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Okay, stay informed. Okay, so once you're at Google, uh, type in HTML5 free templates. Something like that. And there's a lot of websites to pick from, okay? So it doesn't even matter which one you use. And then find the template you want to use. Okay. I'm kind of picky, even though this is a tutorial. I'm picky. Okay, let's just demo this one. Where am I? Okay, go to find the template you want, okay, and then click download. And then open it up. You're going to extract the folder to your desktop, okay. Now, open Dreamweaver. Okay, the first thing you want to do is go to down here, this uh, manage folder kind of thing. Go to manage sites. You're going to want to get a new site. Name, let's give the site a name. Any names works. I'm just going to say new site. And then your local site folder, this is where you just uh, downloaded that template, so the desktop, right here. Just click the folder, click open, don't click anything, click select, and then click save, done. Okay, and that uh, gives your local folder right here, you can see all the files in it, okay, so to start, um, you're going to want to open the index.html because this is the home page. Index.html is another word for home page. Okay. And you got to, and there's no changing that. You have to keep the index.html no matter what. So anyway, once you're here, uh, what you're going to want to do is you, uh, you can preview this, uh, the template in the browser by clicking F12, so let's do that. That's a pretty cool website, I guess. Okay. Now, the catch about using these templates are uh, most people would say, yeah, yeah, you can't use someone else's template, you know, that's copyright. Uh, it's not free, you can't use them for commercial use, da 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 da. But, um, that's kind of hocus pocus because you can I I start my websites uh, every single website I start is from a template okay so the reason is this copyright thing people are scared of they don't the, the only way to get around that is to change everything okay like for example 
this code that the person made is universal, okay? There's H2 tags, header tags, uh, DIV tags. This is just normal image sources tags, okay? So what makes this template his? Um, well, pretty much this little watermark here that you can delete. Okay. Uh, so, I mean, there's nothing here that's special about his website. The only thing he's going to get you on, you can't use a template like literally you can't use these photos. You got to change these photos, okay? And like these boxes, this box right here needs to be changed. Let's click this box. There it is. It's uh, 540 pixels wide, okay? And that's one of the things that he made, okay? Uh, and you're gonna want to change some things up. You don't have to change everything, but okay, you gotta change some things. So this is your website, not his website. So we'll change the width to the content box to 530, and then that shrinks it up to that, okay? You're just gonna want to play around right here. This H1, the font size is 52 pixels. Let's change that to 36. Boom. So, replace these images, of course. Everything. You just can't have everything exactly the same, or else he's gonna get you for copyright infringement. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And. The most important things about the website is if you were to upload this website how it is, you'd be uploading the title business app analyst website template. That's his title, so you gotta delete that. You gotta make your own title. Say so new website or something. Actually, I'm gonna have a link to this video right now. If you click find this link, just click here. And I'll teach you all about the meta tags, okay? You gotta have meta tags before you start a website, okay? And once you're done with the website, you're like, all right, how do I get this to the, how do I get this online? Like, how do I make a domain? How do I make a website? www.mywebsite.com, you know? Well, I'll have links to all those videos. I've already explained how to do this in other videos, okay? This video was just to show you Basically, how to start a website, how to get it all loaded, okay, on Dreamweaver. You're going to want to change the content and whatnot, and just watch my other videos on how to get this website onto a server, onto a GoDaddy server, okay? And please subscribe. I'm so in love with you.